Ooh. Two little piggies sitting in a box. <laughs> I don't know where I was going to go with that. I was thinking a song like, This little piggy went to the market. This little piggy stayed at home. This little piggy was small. This little piggy was big. I got two. Okay, I didn't trap Ooh. that guy. That guy fell in there himself. That's his problem. He was up here wandering around with... Dur -dur -dur, boom, and fell in. That's not my problem. But the other guy, the little guy... That was me. And uh, you guys saw me name this guy Zig. 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 Zombie and pig. <laughs> Get it? Zig. Um, and this guy, thanks to Kaniva, what a great name. Oh, his name is, you can't, oh shoot, oh shoot. Let's go up, okay. His name is, ah, oh, dang it. Okay, one more try, come on. Here we go. Third time's a charm, right? That's what, we, that's what we decided last time. Third time's a charm. In the quake. Okay, his name is Short Stack Von Face Melter. That's his name. Mm -hmm. I haven't decided what I want to do with him yet. I'm kind of thinking I'm going to put him on top of my house, and he'll patrol my house. He'll just constantly be going around my house. going to put some tracks up there, and he'll just go around my house. That's what I'm thinking. So, um, I want to show you guys this at night, the base. But, uh... I got a little bit of um, updates on the mob farm that we made, which is, oh jeez, I wonder if I'm going to lose my, don't lose the clay, don't lose the clay, I said don't lose the clay, okay, I guess we could, oh yeah, shoot, I, uh, can we see, oh yeah, right here, <laughs> that's what I wanted to see, so as you guys can see, I got rid of that whole water drop thing. What I did is I made a, um, I made trip wires that activate pistons right there, right there, right there, and right there. So whenever a mob falls down on any one of those, it waits. Uh, if it's on the, if it falls on the lower, because there's two of them that are lower, and there's two of them that are higher, right? So if it falls on the lower side, so these, this one and this one, it waits four ticks, repeater at max, and then it pushes them out. Um, the other one, if it's on the high one, it waits like six or eight ticks, game ticks, and then it uh, extends the pistons and pushes them down. Um, dang it. Now I gotta go down and get that clay. Let's go down and get it. Uh, so I, oh, now I'm stuck in here. Do I have my soap touch on me? I don't, oh, I know, but I have got a pain, so we can repair this right away. Um, what was I saying? The, um... The mob spawn rate wasn't that great. I AFK'd it over the night, and I had, like, half of that. I did it for, like, one night this morning. I got, like, double the supplies I did all last night. So last night, I was like, okay, let's, um... There should be some, There should be a block there. Um, so I was like, last night, I was like, all right, let's go. You know, there's got to be a, some sort of... You know, I hadn't lit up the area, and that's why I want to show you guys it, this at night. Um, I lit up the area... Not a, not all of over there, but I lit up all of this and all of that and all of that and the rest of this down here. Um, I also went out and I noticed every time I, like yesterday when I was AFKing and last night, I noticed that a lot of times whenever I'd come back just to check if, if this was making any good progress, that would always have like seven, eight mobs on it. And I was like, uh, that needs to definitely get lit up then. So I lit that up and I made sure that was lit up good. And then, uh, stay here for a little bit and I was like, ah, man, there's still gotta be a lot of some, you know, I, I know, oops, I knew I hadn't like lit up the caves very well below me. So I went down there and oh my gosh, I, um, man, it's, let's, I'll, I'll, I'll go show you guys. It's like insane. I just have so much cave down there that I didn't ever realize. I, I, uh, my original first cave when I first got over here was I dug down over here. I just, um, it's right over there. I just dug a staircase down and I went into, found a, a first cave. Well, I went down that stairway again and I looked for entities around there. And man, was there a lot of entities in this one area that I was able to find. And it led me to this huge cave that I had no clue was down here first off and it's massive I mean it goes the I I knew there was a ravine ravine oh I need to turn my hostile mob zones down oh not video music music hostile mobs we can turn that up um 
So I found this cave. <laughs> this cave is huge. And I, I don't know. It came down and I just found all sorts of branches and that I have, of a cave system that I had no clue was down here. And there was like, every time I looked at my entities, let's see if we see any. Too, not too bad. Let's go to maybe like, is there more? If I go over here. But it was literally, see, like there's seven or eight over here. So I wonder what's, if we go down here, there's probably some sort of system over here. If we go over here. Okay, where'd it go? Where'd all those entities go? Okay, they're up. So I don't know, you know, these could be on the surface too. That I'm, oh, I don't, oh, let's, we want to fill that back in because I don't have the torches. My bad, my bad. We don't have the torches to really do that, so we're not going to even bother with it right now. But I, I, I was coming through and I was just looking at entity counts, like going through and looking at the walls, looking for entity counts. And I was finding like a lot of places that had 20, 30 entities and I was like, oh man. So I'd go down there and sure, sure enough, there was... A crap ton of, ent you know, I'd find a cave system, there'd be like seven or eight mobs down there, and I'd keep going down, and I'd just keep finding mobs, mobs, I was like, dang, you know, that had, that was definitely affecting the, the rate at which I was getting mobs, so I was like, oh, we need to light this up, so I, between all the lighting up there and all the lighting down here, I might, I know it might be a little excessive as you look down, like a lot of torches, but, um, I went through almost, I had my two rows of my inventory full, Two rows, so these two rows were completely full. These two slots were full, and I had these slots right here full. All of torches. And that's how many torches I lit up. And I'm not even, I know I'm not even close to finished yet. Um, but it's definitely a good pro, good start. But like I said, this isn't, this mob, oh, nope. good. I didn't want that guy anyways. I really didn't. I didn't need him, and I didn't want him, and I was figuring how to get him out of there. But I guess getting out of the area and unloading him works. Um, so Von Face Melter can, uh, be all, Stack Mac Von Face Melter can be all by himself. Um, so, but like I said, this is never, this was, this mob farm isn't made to be a, you know, oh, give me all sorts of resources. It's just made for a little bit of extra so that, ah, sorry, my throat, it just, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> um, but this is just made for, so that I, I have a little bit of extra, so I don't always have to go to Urit and get TNT or go to Wumbo and get a bunch of gunpowder or some, you know, Hunter or Vodka and get a bunch of gunpowder. I can have, you know, a steady supply of it. You know, that's only what, five TNT or so, but, you know, over time, you know, I don't use TNT that often. Um, but over time, you know, that will accumulate and that'll be nice, especially like when I'm working. You'll, you know, every night you'll get a couple extra, uh, so it's just something nice to have. But if you guys notice, I have 30 levels. <laughs> um, that 30 levels came from all that caving I did. Uh, so what do we want? I'm kind of thinking. Hmm, should we do a sword? I don't need a pickaxe. I got a bunch of silk touch. I got a bunch of fortune. And what do I also have in here? I have a silk touch and a fortune in here. I don't need any of that. We don't need that anymore. We don't need that. We don't need that. We can put that stuff away. Um, right there. There goes those. Um, hmm. Sam? What should we enchant, guys? Hmm. Maybe a pair of boots? We don't need a shovel. We don't really need an axe. I could enchant a book, but I kind of want to enchant a pair of boots. Let's see if we can get lucky on a pair of boots. So let's go ahead and take these boots and uh, make them boots. Man, is is the sound like, I don't know if it's my sound that's low or what it is, but that was really low. Okay, there we go. Now we can hear these guys. All right, what do we all got? We, I have something in here cooking in one of these. Nope, never mind. No, I don't. Look at it. Let's see if the mobs spawn. We can check that out. Oh, it's getting night, so that means I can show you guys. All right, let's get a pair of boots. Good pair. Come on, 30 levels. Give me it. Fuck. Jesus, sickles and the donkey. Ugh. Dang it. Dang it. That doesn't work. That does no good. Who wants projectile protection? I'm, I mean, the unbreaking's nice, but... 
Dang it. That was a... Uh, boo. Let's throw... Garbage. Nope. Okay. Garbage. There you go. All right. Let's go... Uh, let's, let's go show you guys what is all going on out here. With all this touching up. Oh, see, look at that. Look at them mobs. Look at it. Got some mobs already going in there. One. Yeah. That works. Whatever. You know, and... And you could stack up and get like our however high it is, get sixty blocks or whatever, and unload some of the some of the caves down there and whatnot, so that they're only spawning on the surface. And up here, since I have the surface pretty well, it'd be mainly in here. But you know, I I uh, what you oh that's I want to do that too. Show you guys all this. I I uh, AFK right there, and so that's loaded. Give me iron. This is loaded. Getting me ice, and this is loaded now too. Spawning mobs. So. All of that combined is uh is nice. So if we go over here and look, got all that lit up nicely. Like I said, we have to still light up over there. Obviously, you can even see an Enderman spawn over there. Um, that is um not gonna get lit up because I don't want it lit up right now. And all that stuff all over there, I don't know if it's really loaded all that much. Ooh, I, I need to torch this up a little bit. Uh let's go. Let me go show you guys. Let's see. Let's see how far we can make from here. Woo! Woohoo! Did I make it? Am I gonna make it? Nope. That's not. No. That that's even farther than normal. Even farther than normal. So let's see how much iron I got over here. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Ah, nice amount of iron. Let's grab all of that and fill it back in. There we go. Perfect. That is just great. That's nice little, nice little accumulation of iron. Uh, after we gave Kniva all that with that prank, it kind of, uh, kind of took away a lot of my iron. So, <laughs> but I'm gonna go mine that ice over there because it is full, or go collect that ice because it is full, and uh, it's not generating any more ice. So um, we'll go do that, and we'll see you guys in a little bit. Oh, the joys of having an ice farm. Just this is so cool. Love it. Anyone on the far side wants to come over and do this and just relieve a lot of, you know, stress or whatever you got going on, feel free. It's open to use. I probably won't charge you though because I'm like that. <laughs> no, I'm just joking. If anyone on the far side wants to come over. And just give it a try whenever it's full. Um, just make sure if you come over and do it, don't mine out that row. That row right there. The row above the pistons, don't mine it out. Just don't do it. Oh, let's just... Oh, oh, so let's see how much ice we get from this. I'll bring... <laughs> this is so cool. I just, I love doing this. Even though I don't need ice right now, it's nice to accumulate it. But it's just even just so much fun just doing this. Ha! So, we got... That's not too bad. The what this one over here wasn't as full as this one over here, but that is two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, fifteen and a half stacks of ice. Woo! That is delicious. Did we make it? Did we make it? No. We hit the side of the flooping Rubik's cube. Okay. <laughs> we should go check to see if Sirens is in the death games. That's what we should do. That is what we should do. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. <laughs> what was that? I'm pretty sure that was a chicken. Yeah. That was a chicken. <laughs> oh. oh my gosh, I'm trying to transfer. Okay, okay. Hey, hey you. You stay, you stay. You stay. I'm trying to transfer this guy. Come on. Yes, okay. Woo. I, was <laughs> I was trying to transfer that guy to... Whew. That scared me. I was, I, I, why, why is it that, uh, connect? Hey, you, you connect. You connect with, uh, this. There you go. Why is it, why is it that these guys can fit in a, like, the baby zombie pigmen can fit in a, they're only one block high, while the zombie pig, or the baby zombies, they aren't one block high, like, he should, like, a baby zombie wouldn't have been able to fit through that. Oh, scared me. Oh, another one. 
How you doing, dude? Put you up there. Go. Yes. So, <laughs> let me show you guys what I've been doing. I, uh, nope. Ooh, nice. So, this guy's my little protector. Uh, short stack Vaughn face melter. He's my little protector. He's going to protect me from anyone trying to come through the nether. He's just, he's going to be my watch, my watch out here. I got to redo my roof a little bit over here. Um, just because this block has, this has to be a full block for it to push it back. Um, I tried half slabs and stuff, just didn't work. Um, so, he is going to be my little dude. He's just going to sit here and watch. Constantly going. Yeah. Haha. -ha. Short stack Von face melter. How you doing? You got a brother here now. Hmm. What should we do with this guy? I, I don't know what I'm going to do with that guy yet. I'm thinking maybe... Hmm. I don't know. It would be kind of interesting. You know, this guy's probably going to go wherever I end up, like, building a bedroom or whatever. He's going to go somewhere around there. That's where he's going to go. Um, so let's just take this down. I didn't really have any, like, too big of plans, like, let's do this today. So I've just kind of been going around and seeing what are things I can do. And I, that's what I decided I was going to do today. Um, so that's why I just sporadically decided to put him up there. Because that's where I wanted I wanted to do that. And so uh, let's go get that silk touch and take that take care of that. So if we <laughs> the only kind of weird thing um, about having him right there is if we go inside now. Oh, I only have 400 pills anymore. Um, if we go inside. Oops. Oops. A little, a little too happy. If we go inside now, we have a block there and a redstone block there. Eh, it just adds a little character. Who cares? It just it looks good. Um, right? Right? Mm -hmm. Um, so, what was I doing? What was I doing in here? Put that back. Put those back. What was I doing? Huh. I came in here to get something. What was it? Oh, yeah. Silk touch. Silk touch pick, because we want to get all those glass panes, because that's a lot, that's a decent amount of lime green glass stain, glass panes, so we might as well get that, oh, booze online, we should go see if he's in the death games, <laughs> just to have a little bit of fun, um, but I'm just gonna dismantle all of this, and, uh, do my thing, do my thing by dismantling, you know, um, uh, it's a little cold, it's starting to get, I live in California, it's starting to get a little, you guys might be thinking if you live in the Midwest or anywhere that gets actually cold, you might be thinking, cold? California? No way. Yeah, it does, it's not like cold, cold. I grew up in the Midwest, so I know what cold is like, but, you know, once you live in California for so long, and it's just a different, like, you get used to the being warm, and now, I'm gonna, this is gonna sound ridiculous, I think it's like 70, maybe upper 60s right now, 70 out, early morning, I get up early morning and play, um, but it is, like, that's why my nose is a little... <laughs> like clogged and it's just it's a little chilly my toes are freezing they're pretty cold i should really have like socks on or something and my fingers are cold like my reaction time slow for my fingers and yeah it's just it's uncomfortable but that's something i <laughs> you guys do that a lot i i tend to do that like i'll be a, just a tad bit too far away from the the box i want to get to like i thought i could get it boom and then you throw an ender pro and you're like right on top of it so let's go to my rails there we go there we go there we go there we go mm -hmm. there we go so now we got a little guardian up there to watch over us while we're here and uh got some string back in the process it looks like also so let's see if we got any um let's see how this mob farm did if we've got anything i, I think we had like what are you doing you're not supposed to be here you're not supposed, he can't he came from over there i can guarantee it um I don't remember how many, I think we had like 16 gunpowder, and that's like the big thing I'm looking for. So like 16 gunpowder, and us oh, so we got like one. Which, like I said, not a big deal. I'm not looking to get huge gains out of it. It's just something to be able to uh, have a little bit of, um, you know, a little bit of extra for. Oh, whoa, whoa, hey. Hey, there we go. So, uh, yeah, what else can we do today? Like I said, no real big plans. Just kind of a, just kind of a day to kind of do things. I wanted to try to optimize that the best I could by lighting up the area and lighting up underneath. And yeah, ho oh, ho, witch! Oh, the witch! Hey, let's let's go let's go watch out witch fall. Let's go watch out witch fall. Come on, witch! 
Come on, witch. Come on. Oh, really? I didn't account for guys like you. Where'd the witch? Ha <laughs> ha witch! Witch! Witch be dead, witch be dead. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I didn't account for guys like you. That's fine. When I log or whatever, it's... Goldstone! Glowstone! Not goldstone, glowstone. Sweet! Sweet, sweet, sweet. But guys, anyways... I know this wasn't a very, like, productive, let's build something type of episode, which usually I do, but, uh, I just felt like not, um, I didn't really feel like there was anything that I wanted to build today, um, I have ideas, but just, I didn't have the supplies for them right now, and I, um, have stuff I gotta do today, so, but anyways, I'm gonna leave you with this clip of Kaniva trying to kill me in the death games, um, Go check out Kaniva. I was told, sorry Kaniva, but I was told that he was coming to get me. So I was fully prepared for him waiting. And this is a clip of, of a couple of guys that were in the Skype call with me. Uh, Sneeg, um, Wumbo, and Urit, I think it was. Um, by the way, Teg. <laughs> uh, so go check them all out. And I hope you guys enjoy this clip. But thanks for watching. My name's Vilasa. Dream big. Back watch. <laughs> All right, so Wombo just told me that Kniva's coming after me in the hunger or in the in the uh, what you want to call it? Oh, you added him to the call? Death games. Did I say welcome back to him? Welcome back. Feel nice. <laughs> He's probably recording like I'm gonna get killed. This <laughs> Saying welcome back he's going to the He's going games. to the portal. He's in the portal and he's gone. To my base or to I by the spawn. He just he went through spawn. I don't know where he is now. It's like, like yep. Okay, so it's gonna activate. It's gonna activate that block. Block. What happens if I activate yes. a block? I'll just wait at the portal or like block the portal up with obsidian. <laughs> That way you can't get out. That'd be hilarious. <laughs> uh, He's probably already at your base now, now, now though. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I'm just going to stand up here by my redstone. There's only one way he can get in and out of here and get up here, so I'll hear the ender pearl when he gets here. <laughs> Hi, Kaniva. I'm waiting. <laughs> okay, so... Potion. Gosh, when he there's, finds out, there's my he's strength, gonna be angry. there's my regen, and my speed. Okay. I, oh, I need to have redstone in my like hand. <laughs> Dude, you're just gonna be like, oh, he was waiting for me. <laughs> you should just put it all on right now. Depending on <laughs> just have all the buffs on. What the hell are you doing? Oh, I just always have buffs on at all times. <laughs> <laughs> just, just have all those potions on you. I have little potion stations <laughs> all over your base. Okay, or just so... have your entire inventory full of potions. I'm crouching and like uncrouching, so it looks like my uh, looks like I'm working on redstone. <laughs> <laughs> I'm playing this out perfectly. Him? No, I don't see him yet. Taking his merry time. Ain't <laughs> he is taking his big merry time. My tunnel, my tunnel's short. He's just where, like working where I'm working time. though, I don't have that big of a platform like for him to <laughs> to be able to land on. So. If he ender pearls up here, he's gonna be like right next to me. Oh god! Oh. <laughs> this falls down. Dude, I don't think this is possible. What I'm trying to do. Uh oh. Did he ever finish the courthouse? Oh, I see him. <laughs> <laughs> Told you. Where's he at? Where's he at? <laughs> Get him. <laughs> <laughs> Damage him like ninety percent. I had oh, one hit on him. <laughs> <laughs> oh jeez. Yeah, we there is. Oh, I need to make those armor make the armor a bit better. No. It's only because he was waiting for him the whole time. Uh, but still. Well terrible. even if I wouldn't have been, he would have I he still would have been dead because he tried ender pearling up to me. And when right. he did that, it was yeah, yeah, it was over. <laughs> 